Well, hello there and good day. Thank you for joining me. I am Frost PDP, and today we're playing Brigandine as New Almikia. This is episode 19 of our campaign, where we are fighting the Empire on all fronts, although this is a castle. We might have to surrender when it's all said and done. At least he says I savor the chance to test my skill. You will not escape my wrath. Meanwhile, Solilo says, what can I do? I must keep fighting. Well, you're outnumbered by a significant margin. But he's not running. So my buddy Veracity likes to edit this stuff out. And I kind of don't blame him. I mean, watching people just march troops up takes forever, and it's like, blah. It's not really the point of the game. But, I like my viewers to be able to, to see, at least when I'm playing, what the thought process behind my troop arrangements is. I have a level 10 vampire. That's pretty cool. I can't see. This lady is gonna take a while. I wonder why he. why Soliel was the guy who, uh. said anything in that right. Shame he can't be recruited. Beast King for his amazing skill at taming creatures. This is just some guy. He became. He thinks it's in God's plan that this all happens. This is an open field battle, son. You don't know what you're getting yourself into. God's plan or not. Stabilize the advance a bit. Lots of pixies, but not lots of heals. And my vampire is not getting into battle anytime soon, let's put it that way. Yeah, I just realized. I could face them like that and deal with their monsters. Or I can head a little bit more north. Do like a north shift. Yeah, that's kind of what I want to do.
he's aggroed. What do I think they're going to try to hit first? Probably the lizard man. Or the Mandrake, that's fine. I actually did a really good counter defensive. Um, I'm not gonna lie. Favorite Life of Riley character. Nibble. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Level one enchantress. Please kill this. One ninety four XP. She didn't even level up once. Zombies actually really exposed. Went for my gin, huh? That's mean. It's downright mean. It's cruel. That was downright foolish. Chubby! Should've done that before you attacked. Can my unicorn heal it? No. Hey, I'm giving him a fighting chance. If he dies, he dies. Does he have enough to do 160? That's the question. 181. One enemy down. And look, we have a breakthrough in the northern front. Did 
Do I want to do that, or do I just want to try to start hitting this, uh, this dinosaur? This is a sure way to get him nuked, but I don't care. They do have a healer. Paralyze! Damn. Guessing. Ooh. Hello. You're silly. Paralyzed? Nah. That's not getting anywhere in time. Critical 127. We get back 31. Holy word the crap out of me if I don't get careful. Yeah, it's time for him to That's bad. That's not good. He's got my line in sight really. Yeah, you missed. <laughs> this one dude is going berserk. <laughs> Should rename him Guts. Right, what the hell do I do? Hold on, I gotta take my sweater off. Sorry about that. Ah, uh, brother, you suck. Mandrake's pretty much dead. The giant's got some life left in it. Peck at each other. I like it when you peck at each other that way. First fear. Yep. Hurts it. Four. She could probably frost it. If you don't frost it at three monsters, probably not kill anything. Regular frost, on the other hand, probably will kill this. She's making a killing. Level two now, huh?
I'm not walking in. I'm not, I'm not hitting you if I don't have to. It's not going to do much, but it's going to hurt you. Decided to go with the acid breath. Interesting choice, pal. It hurts. Definitely hurts. Oof. It's gonna kill. 300. 248. That's pretty bad. Do I just bail? Hasn't killed any of mine yet. Mandrake has to hit this dragon, try to stun it. Worked. Chopper chopper. Chopper chopper. Uh, uh, my vote is GTFO. Dragon surrounded, let's eliminate it as much as we can. That, that guy's dead. <laughs> You're gonna heal? It's bold. My zombie. Holy, holy hell. Well, that's not good. It's not that strong. Yeah. 
That thing's toast. Just in case you think it's something smart like casting your acid breath again. Nah, not happening. I keep pushing the Vampire Lord is kind of the question. I need to stagger this correctly. No retails is better than any retails. So move up. Now Weaver is out of the blue and I know it, but it's just I can't do much about it. Ooh, flame, huh? Okay. That hurt. That's gonna do more damage too. You're hurting me, I'm not gonna lie. Really? You hit my gin? You punched it? Run away! Now the time comes to sacrifice something. Or not. Five, do I think I can do it? First of all, there's no sense in not hitting the paralyzed dragon to maybe keep it paralyzed. I hate doing this to you, Pixie, but I need every last hit point taken off this thing. 23 might be the difference. One sixty-two. That was the difference.
Meow meow. 210. Wow. Kind of in the blue, though. He bailed. I mean, she's bailing. Free kills. Cortina after all. I probably should have. Well, I can definitely move my wolf up. Take a bite out of him. Gobble. One hundred sixty-eight XP. That's pretty good. It's not going to do much, but it'll hurt him. Eighty-seven. He's at fifty hit points. I almost killed him. Maybe. Maybe there's a shot. You got your payoff, baby. Critical 101. Defeated. How awkward. That is exactly what you get. Oh, six levels. Scargis' army is in retreat. With minimal losses, we are victorious. Miki at Torah, victory. Now for the fun stuff. The real challenge in battle. Uh, did not realize I'd be attacking across a bridge. pick this up next episode. I want to thank you all so much for joining me. If you enjoyed this episode, please hit the like and subscribe buttons. It does help the channel grow. It lets me know what you're watching so I can make more of it. And I really do appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. And as always on this channel, La Paz.